I'm Sandy Wells. Um, I live in the Hudson Valley. I have several businesses. Um, I'm a coach and an educator. And uh, one of my businesses is the Institute for Mindful Living, and the other one is called Wellspring. Partly the reason why I came to this class is that I hate the question, what do you do? I really don't like that question. And um, I've, over the years, it's occurred to me that there are probably stories that say what I do, but I can never think of them in the moment. Um, I am not great at marketing. I don't market. I don't do any marketing at all. Um, I haven't advertised in years, and I have plenty of business. But I really think it's time to, you know, establish the answer to that question. Maybe not answer it, what I do, but be able to tell the story of who, who I am and what I can offer. Well, you know, the course is really, I guess this goes back to the, the idea about a marketing course, you know, I've taken plenty of those just because I'm curious and I'm a learner. And this course is not an information course. It's not a knowledge product. It's a transformation course. So it is a journey that you um, take deeply into your own backstory. Where did you come from? What are your motivations? Um, what do you want to change in the world? How do you see the world? So for me, that journey is um, ongoing. I'm still in it. And uh, just because the course is 10 weeks, you can do a lot in 10 weeks. And at the same time, it stays alive. It's still very much alive in me. I want to go back and rewrite my missions. Um, I had a amazing coaching experiences with Michael he really helped me kind of drill down into what's more true and what's more accurate and really um, what's the deeper story. I think one of my beliefs um, that's shifted has to do with how I understand story and how it's linked to possibility. So I'm already finding myself uh, asking my clients more about their stories and um, the difference between living in a story that's about a problem or a pathology. You know, the typical model in our country is symptom, diagnosis, treatment, or problem, solution. And as we look at stories that have possibility and then we can really empathize well of course that wouldn't have happened yet because um, it changes everything and I think for me I've been on the alert for um, the the embedded possibility in any story even when it's not a very happy story so um, I think that's one of the things, one of the beliefs and the attitudes that's changing for me. Thank you. And lastly is, can you describe the great result result or impact for you? Thus far, I always like to add. <laughs> yeah, right, right, thus far. Um, hmm. Let's see. So I think one, one impact for me that is very, um, that was kind of a surprise was that I have been maybe hiding for the last couple of years, I've had a lot of stuff going on in my life, a lot of reasons not to be on my blog, a lot of reasons not to be tweeting and doing all those things that people do, and I've, been do I've done them in the past. And now I just feel very inspired, and that partly came out of um, the active community that we have on Facebook and also in the forums. So if, you know, if people are thinking about taking this class, one thing I would say on the front end is 
start looking through the forum to see who your colleagues are. I've met some amazing people in this course, and their feedback has been valuable. I've had fun giving them feedback, and I've actually posted on my blog recently and sent out a few tweets because now something is, you know, brewing inside, and that's that's when we start to have something to say that's really connected, not just like, oh, God, I need to make another post. So I think that's one of the real um, surprises for me out of the class. I'm inspired. I mean, that, that's, that's the main thing for me. It was a wonderful experience. 